my opinion of Game 1, 2019 Eastern Conference Finals. Kyle Lowry was dominating that first three quarters. We didn't see much from Leonard. I don't know what happened there specifically. Um, but Lowry was on fire. He, he shot like 30 points, threes, charges, defense. He did everything there. He's he playing like he has... He doesn't have a max contract and is fighting for one, but he's, I guess he wants to make his presence known in these conference finals. Brook Lopez, the closer of the game, shot threes. He was on fire in that fourth quarter. Threes, tippins, where his arms grabbed by Marcus Saul and everything. I think Marcus, Marcus Saul did a great job guarding Giannis, but he's going to have problems if he has to guard Giannis and, uh, I guess they didn't really use Ibaka. I don't know if he wasn't playing, if it was because of stitches, but like if they had Ibaka, he'd have a little bit of help guarding Giannis and then Brook Lopez too. I don't even know if he can guard Brook Lopez. I just used the three, how tall he is. He's a little, but, I don't know. Gasol and Lowry were very good defensively, guarding, doing the right fouls, guarding people. Brook Lopez's career high for points, 29 points. Most since his playoff game last time. I think he's only been on like two playoff rounds. I'm not sure. Like Brogdon did a presence. I don't know if Chris Milton did much. Brogdon was good in the transition. I, before, before that second and third quarter, I thought... I would always consider Eric Bledsoe better than the Kyle Lowry. But then we showed the 2019-2018 Kyle Lowry when he's shooting threes and just doing phenomenal defense and stuff. That's just the charges, but staying in front of people. Yeah, that's about it. What are your thoughts? Like and subscribe.